Hi everyone, in this video we are going to find Taylor series expansion of a function sin z at point z is equal to 0. Okay, so I have already mentioned the given function. So Taylor series expansion we can find if the function is analytic around that point, the point is 0. So it should be analytic in a neighborhood of 0. But see sin z is entire function. That means it is analytic everywhere on C. So let me mention, see clearly, sin z is an entire function. Okay, it is entire function. That means it is analytic at each and every point of a complex plane. So definitely we can find its Taylor series expansion. So let us find now by Taylor series expansion. So by Taylor series expansion, what can I write? Let me mention first, if of z is equal to summation, I'm writing the general form and running from zero to infinity, nth derivative of f at z naught upon n factorial z minus z naught raised to n. So when we want Taylor series at point z naught, we express it, the given function in this way. But see here z naught, that means a given point is zero. So let me mention here, here, the given point z naught is zero. So let us put it here. So therefore f of z, which is sin z. Okay, so let me mention sin z is equal to summation and running from zero to infinity, nth derivative of f at point z naught is zero upon n factorial. Here also the z naught is zero. So that's why simply I can mention z raised to n. Okay, so let us expand it. So we will get clear cut idea about the series. Expand that means I'm going to put n is equal to 0, 1, 2 and so on. If I put n is equal to 0, we will have 0th derivative. That means the original function f of 0, 0 factorial, which is 1, z raised to 0, which is also 1. So that means only one term is there f of 0. Let us put n is equal to 1. So the first derivative of f at 0 upon 1 factorial, z raised to 1, that means z let us put n is equal to 2 now. So here we will have second derivative at 0. Denominator will be 2 factorial and z square. So let us write third derivative of f of 0 upon 3 factorial z cube. Simply I am putting n is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and so on. Okay. So let us write few more st steps. So fourth derivative at 0 upon 4 factorial z is to 4 and the fifth derivative. So there is one way, way to write the same thing or you can write in this way also z is to 5 and so on. So this is my equation number 1. So now our task is to find all those derivatives and let us put their values here. So we will have the required Taylor series expansion of a given function. So let us continue. Uh, see we have this space let us use. Okay, so I'm going to write it here. Uh, we have, what is the function we have? Let us recall first. The function is uh, sin z, okay? So we want its derivative. So let us find all these derivatives one by one. Derivative of sin z is cos z. Double derivative, its double derivative is minus sin z. Triple derivative, which is minus will be as it is. Derivative of sin z is cos z. Fourth derivative, Derivative of cos z is minus sin z, but see minus is already there. So minus minus plus we will have sin z. And the fifth derivative, derivative of sin z is cos z, okay, and so on. And so on. So in this way we found out derivatives. But values of derivatives are not enough. We have to find the values at particular that point 0. So let us find them. So f of 0 f of 0 that means at a place of z we have to put 0 so we will have sin 0 we know that sin 0 is 0 okay let us go further so f dash of 0 here we have to put z is equal to 0 to cos 0 which is 1 f double dash of 0 it's simple calculation at a place of z we have to simply put 0 and we have to find the values of those sin 0 cos 0 and so on so here we will have minus sin 0, but sin 0 is 0, so that's why we will have 0 again. 
ट्रिपल डेरिवेटिव राइट हियर आई एम पुटिंग जीरो माइनस कॉज जीरो कॉज जीरो इज वन बट सी माइनस साइन इज ऑलरेडी देयर सो दैट्स वाई शू राइट माइनस वन सो यस लेट एस राइट फॉर फ्यू मोर टर्म्स फोर्थ डेरिवेटिव एट जीरो विच इज साइन जीरो जीरो एंड फिफ्थ डेरिवेटिव ओके एट जीरो which is cos 0 that means 1 and so on and so on okay so for few terms we have calculated so now we have to put all those values in equation number 1 see there is no more space to write so make a screenshot of it then we will go further see then one becomes okay i'm going to put all those values so sin z we are finding the taylor series expansion of sin z f of 0 is 0 let me mention 0 plus a dash of 0 is 1 so here we will have 1 upon 1 factorial z f double dash of 0 is 0 f triple dash of 0 is minus 1 so i should write minus 1 upon what we have 3 factorial z cube plus fourth derivative is 0 again 0 into anything 0 fifth derivative is 1 So one upon five factorial z is to five and so on. So let us write properly. One factorial is one. So z minus sign is there. Minus z cube upon three factorial plus z is to five is there upon five factorial and so on. So this is required Taylor series expansion of sin z at z is equal to zero. So in this way we completed this problem. So make a screenshot of it. Then we will stop. Thank you. See you.